my responsibility. Hallowed be thy name, that you'd be believed, that you'd be feared, that your commandments would be kept and that you'd be glorified. And not to do this, I separate from the world and I'd be willing to die for your name. See, that, when we have that kind of theology, that kind of intensity, makes God real. But when in God's name, when we just say, hallowed be thy name, and we've done it out of respect, and it's only a statement. The moan is, is, is round. It doesn't have a relevancy and a connection and a responsibility to us. But hallowed be thy name does. Because when we have a life that says, I'm willing to live it all out for him, we call it the lordship of Jesus Christ. God says, you know what? That kind of life counts That's when the non-believer looks. And when you have cancer, you go through cancer as a Christian glorifying God. Or when when, when something happens to your child, or something happens to your eyes, or something happens with your employment, whatever, that we do it in Christian principles and values, and we, we, we live not plastic lives, just smiling, but we live in a sense of biblical reality. God says, I can use that kind of a life for my kingdom. And my will and my kingdom can come. Do you see, my friends, why I've been eager to share this with you? Oh, it's my prayer that that some of the, the phoniness of our lives, some of the phoniness, there's just some phoniness that in Christian lives that is phony is is television, uh, wrestling on television. And that kind of phoniness and that kind of giving in and that kind of putting God's name among many different priorities will not accomplish what God wants to accomplish. But if we pray it, oh, Father, you're my Father, it's, I bring a statement of praise and of love to you It's your heaven. I know that I'm going there. And if your first petition and first priority is that your name be hallowed, Father, that's the kind of life I want. I want you to cause people to believe you. I want your you to cause people to fear you. I want you to cause people to live out your commandments. I want you to cause people to glorify you. And Father, my responsibility... I'm going to separate from the world. I'm going to be distinctive. And even in fact, if I've got to suffer for your name, hallowed be thy name.